Good morning, Los Angeles. It is the first day of the winter quarter and it is cold, rainy, and gloomy to match my mood. I'm not too happy about waking up this early, but I am about to get some breakfast and head out to class. At B Plate, I got a ginger banana walnut pancake and an omelet with everything on it for breakfast. Here's a reminder of what my schedule looks like this quarter. So it's pretty chill and I have four classes. I will be taking you guys through each of those classes. Here's a quick snapshot of the classroom for my phonology lecture. It's a pretty big classroom. I would say it seats probably about like 75 students. And here's some of the notes that I took. I wasn't really allowed to film in that class because we can't use any electronic devices. Hey guys, just got out of ASL class. The rain finally stopped. It was pretty crazy earlier, but now I'm walking to the bookstore to hopefully pick up my book if they have it and maybe get like some notebooks and stuff like that and I'll take you guys along. On my way to the bookstore, I stopped at the Transfer Student Center to ask a question and they had this little transfer wall. So I wrote the name of my community college, West Valley College, on it. If you can uh, see your community college on here, leave a comment down below and let me know where you plan on transferring from. to show you guys what I got at the bookstore earlier when I went after class. Um, so I'll just start off with the textbook. So this is my ASL textbook and it's actually a workbook and it comes with like these DVDs and this like access code. So I bought it there because I needed to buy a new one but then when I went she asked me if I wanted to rent it and she said that I was allowed to write it and write in it and everything so I was like oh, hell yeah I'll rent it. So it was $30 cheaper than expected. I also got to rent this iClicker 2 which was great because I didn't know you could rent these and it's used so I got it for even cheaper and then these two things were $95 together which is great because this textbook was going to be $95 alone if I were to order it new online which I tried to do last night it didn't work which is a miracle. I also got this because I have a feeling I'm going to use for my cognitive science class. I got the eye clicker for cog science and then I got another notebook. I'll probably have to go back and get another one for my morphology class. Um, or I might use this one for the morphology class and lastly I got one of these like envelope folder things. I like these for paper, uh, for like handouts and papers and things like that better than traditional folders just because I feel like they contain everything and nothing falls out or gets squished so um, that is what I scored at the textbook store. If y'all didn't notice I have a guest, Mr. Boujou. Boujou! Hi Boujou. Dude, he's obsessed with me and the feeling is honestly mutual, so I'm so happy that he's in my room right now. He cried at my door last night when he came home until I opened it. It was like almost midnight. Cause he missed me so much. All right, y'all, I just finished my notes for my applied phonetics class. We had about 30 pages of reading in the text, a course in phonetics, so here is what I wrote up. I didn't do, I didn't go too crazy on the notes because a lot of it was review from what I learned in intro linguistics, um, but I'm happy that I did it even though it wasn't assigned. I just want to be really on top of this class because there's a lot of like terminology that we need to know and I want to be clear on each concept. Hey guys, so now it's the next day. Um, this is my Tuesday, Thursday schedule. I'm sorry I didn't film much today because I was running a little bit late, but here I am walking to North Campus to class. Um, as I said, I didn't film my first class because I was running late. In between classes, I just went to Powell, which as you guys know, I usually go to YRL, but I decided to, ch to change it up and I worked on my ASL assignment. It was pretty easy. I just have to like review these videos and answer questions in a workbook and I did this little like type up assignment thing. For lunch I went to BCAF AK Bruin Cafe and I got this new chicken bowl thing that they had. It was pretty good and I was just watching TV chilling. In my cog side class we are allowed to use laptops and tablets which is great. 
I love to type my notes for classes like this where it's just a lot of um, memorization. We just did basic stuff today. She kind of went over the gist of what cognitive science is, which as you guys know, it is my minor. Well, I haven't petitioned for it yet, but after I finish this class, I will petition. Um, so I'm really excited about this class. It was like, it's not even red, it's like wine. I want to introduce Miss Hazelnut to the vlog. This is my roommate Leah's cat. The best roommate ever. The best roommate ever. Um, We're currently trying to socialize her with Buju and she's really not having it. So she was, he's straight up sleeping, right? And she's growling and hissing at him for no reason. And by the way, she followed him over here. What are you guys working on over there? Are you videotaping? Ah! No, Leah, look back. What are you guys doing? Um, I'm doing reading on my queer study class. Nice, nice. Jessica's an English major. And Leah, what are you doing? I'm a little camera shy. Oh my god, okay, you're camera shy. I'm what are you doing, shy. though? I'm reading for my philosophy class. Nice. And Leah's a cognitive science major, and she's being a little shy right Statistics now. Statistics minor. Statistics I've never minor. seen her this camera shy in my life. Trust me, she's nothing like this in real life. I don't like to be put on the spot. She just wanted to put her makeup on, and I didn't give her that opportunity, but we love her anyway. Hey everyone, it's much later. It's like almost eight o'clock right now. I just wanted to talk to you guys about my classes so far and kind of give you an idea of how everything was going. So, um, for Applied Phonetics, it's pretty good. It's, it's all right. I think we're just kind of getting into the swing of things and we're doing kind of basic work right now. So it's not terribly interesting, but I mean, it is something that I would definitely need to know if I am going to pursue speech pathology as a career. Um, so I'm going to be very diligent with my work and do the readings. I've actually already done the reading. Um, I think I showed you guys that. ASL um, manageable once again. It's kind of the same structure as last year and you guys know how much I hated ASL last quarter, but I have to do it. I have to fulfill my language requirement. I mean, at this point it would be such a waste of my time to like start over with a new language. So it's gonna be okay. Then today, which is Tuesday, I went to my other two classes. I had morphology, which I told you guys when I did my enroll vlog, I was really uh, dreading it because I don't really like morphology when we did it in the intro linguistics class I hated it. I was terrible at it. It's really hard to kind of Understand and it's really just one of those things where it's like the more you do it the better you are But it's like if I hate doing it, why would I be motivated to do it more? so I went to class. It's a pretty full class There are like 45 students in like a regular size classroom but the teacher was pretty chill. I wanna show you guys the notes that I took. So he actually gave us a handout, which is great. Both of my teachers are giving handouts. I appreciate that so much because of writing everything by hand, they're not allowing laptops in these classes. Writing everything by hand is annoying to me. So he gave us this handout and just had us, well, he didn't force us obviously to take notes, but as you can see, I wrote in blue ink. Whatever little things I wanted to expand upon or remember that he mentioned, a lot of it was kind of review from what I learned in intro, so that was good. And then lastly, I had um, intro to cognitive science, which I've really been looking forward to. So it's cool. The class is good. I sat in the front. Um, all of my professors this year, with the exception of my ASL professor, because he's uh, the same from last quarter, all my professors are like super young, like literally just got their PhDs last year. So it's kind of interesting. I kind of like older, more experienced professors a little bit better, but you know what? I'm going to give them their fair chance. Obviously they did the work to get there. So yeah, CogSci was good. I think that I'm pretty much going to end this vlog here because um, it's Tuesday, but my classes on Monday, or my classes are the same on Monday, Wednesday, and Tuesday, Thursday. And then on Friday, I just have a discussion, which really isn't anything. It's just like, you know, expansion of what we learned in lecture, answering any questions that we have. So thank you all so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed. I'm sorry, I forgot to record a lot of things, but I hope you at least get an idea of the workload and kind of what's expected and the basic gist of the campus for life of a UCLA student. Bye.